Hi there. Welcome to Chemistry. My name is Mr. Pantano. I'll be your teacher this year. I wanted to take just this short opportunity to introduce myself, but also to tell you a little bit about my class, because I'm betting it's a little bit different from other classes you've been in. For one thing, we're going to be studying chemistry, which you probably haven't done very much of before. But more importantly, is how I run my class and how I teach. Up until about six years ago, my class was like any other science class you're likely to find. I used to lecture in class, I'd assign homework, students would go home, they would try to do the homework, sometimes they'd be successful, sometimes not, and repeat the next day. We'd do labs, we'd practice homework sets, and uh, that was about the extent of it. About six years ago, I started to ask myself a very important question. Is this the best use of my class time? I have 44 minutes for five out of six days with all of you. I want to make sure that the most possible learning happens in that time. And the reality is, sitting there and listening to a lecture, you're not learning very much. You might take in a few things here and there, ask a question, but it's only when you go and take that information and try to apply it to something that you're actually going to be doing the learning. Well, what I started to see was that while students could sit and take notes on a lecture pretty easily, when they went to go do the homework, which is challenging, and which is where a lot of the learning really happens, they'd get stuck. And what happens when you get stuck with your homework? Well, you get frustrated. You might call somebody and see if they can help you, but what if they can't? You might copy off somebody in class. Well, did you learn anything if you do that? Or you might just not do it and say, I just, I don't know how to do this. It's frustrating and it's not really good education. So about six years ago, I started doing things a little differently. Now, the lectures you're going to watch at home because you don't really need me there to watch a lecture. All you have to do is watch and take notes. Plus, you get to pause my lectures or rewind them if you want to go back and hear what I just said again. You can't do that with me. People have tried. So then what do we do in class if I'm not lecturing anymore? We do chemistry. We put into practice the things that you're learning in the lectures. I can answer questions that you might have had about a lecture. We can do lots and lots of experiments and activities and practice so that you're sure to learn the chemistry that we're covering. Not only that, but if you're ever absent, you're never going to miss a lecture because they're up all year long in power school learning and you'll be able to watch them whenever you need to. If you want to go back before a quiz and say, oh, I, I wish I could remember what was in that lecture, just go back and watch it again. Everything's there for you. There's no missed lectures, and in class, we get to actually do chemistry. In the last six years, it's become a very effective way of teaching. My students typically will learn the material much more solidly than they did before and hold on to it for a longer period of time. It's got a great track record, and it's a lot of fun because I get to, I get to know you in class because we get to talk to each other and you get to try stuff. So, it's a little different. I promise you I'll take you through every step of the way. I'll teach you how to do what you need to do, and we'll have a great year. Looking forward to starting out. See you in class.